Residents living around Abadou Road in Dalemo area of Hogan State have called on the state government to come to their aid and fix the roads in the area. This very important road is a boundary between Lagos and Hogan State and has a newly constructed railway that links both states. Residents and other users of the road, including a clergyman Israel Ogundikwe, commercial motorcyclist riders and other members of the communities, led newsmen around the community. They pleaded with the government to come to their aid. They also acknowledge that residents alike have a role to play. I beg um, the state governor to please come and assist us here. We voted and we are really doing a whole lot to support him here. I know our governor is godly. Um, governor Dapabiodo is very godly and is, is a father. And instead of us reacting, we are doing our own best. We have tried a whole lot to do, but we think it's high time for government or Nigerian go, um, Lagos State government to come and assist us. We are really, really begging. We are passionately begging. We are not reacting. We are not fighting against the Nigerian government. We are not fighting against the state government. But we want Governor Dapabiano to come and visit this place and know what is going on. Marshall bus operators and commuters also spoke of their experiences. We normally pay every dues yes. according to the state. Yes. We pay our tax yes. because they spoke to us that we need to pay tax, which we did. We pay tenement rates, everything given to us has been paid, but they have never attended to us here. Our drainage is totally condemned. At times, for about a year, this road was not, it was another thing entirely. No one could, no car could pass because of the drainage, because it will, it will flood to an extent that it will enter into our shop. We, can, we are not gaining anything. And they mobilized us as market people to come and vote for them. We did, but no results yet. Egbado is significant. We remember Egbado because Egbado has been changed to Yewa. And that's the only road in this uh, borderline between Lagos and Ogun State. And for a very long time now, we have been having a very bad road condition, which needs government intervention. The community in this environment, we have tried our best because I happen to be one of the landlords in this environment. And we have contributed a lot of money to repair our roads and many times, but it's enormous. It's not something that we only can handle. So we need the intervention of the government to help us on this road. Some of these people have lived in the area for over 25 years. They also recounted some of their painful moments. We appeal to the governor Biodun to see majority of us see an elderly somebody, see an elderly somebody, including myself, if not the if not intervention of uh, this old shore that been assisting us, which position are we find ourselves? Abiodun should please at all costs. I am a retired pensioner. A labor veteran and appeal to him to be simply be on a compassion and appeal to him to assist us in getting rid of all this mess we find ourselves. We have not been getting government assistance. The residents lamented that during the rainy season the road was completely impassable. They said this resulted in transport fare hike. They said this has affected economic activities in that area. <laughs>